guys, welcome to the channel. Today we've got the Rose uh, Kiss of the Rose Princess Volume 2. So, as you can see on the front, we have the uh, White Knight and the Anas and Anase. So I will tell you the name, I just can't remember the keep I keep forgetting the name so easily. I'll tell you in a minute because in, inside the book it does tell you about the characters. Let me go through in a second. The story and the art is by Aya Shouata. Excuse me. And here's the back cover. So it says here, fearing her absent father will return and discover her rose choker is missing, and so commands her knights to do a search for the necklace. Before they can set out, new transfer student Haruto Kinsuki appears, which her and she knit him new. Uh, were friends back when she was living in Osaka. Os I can't say it. And her four knights, especially Kande, do not trust him. And they are correct not to trust him because he's the yellow rose. Um, he's the yellow rose, yeah. And the yellow rose, he doesn't need anyone to summon him. He doesn't um, think and um, he can use his powers. And he wants, he doesn't, he's like, you do not need the other four cards. You can use me all you need. I'm like, so you're going to kill the other ones just because you want her to use you? I don't get it. Um, and then her father appears, tells Haruto to back off. And he's like, yes, sir. I'm like, wait, is her father a bad guy? What is going on here? Then we find out he, she goes back and talks to the teacher and says, that you knew my dad, the society stuff, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then from that um, part as well, um, what was that? Haruto comes back and kidnaps the blue rose, the blue, the blue knight, and he said, this is my fate. I'm like, your fate is not to be kidnapped by some idiot that wants to be loved and lo loved from by Anase because he's a weird person. So now, then she drops the cards and goes, no, I can't take this. I just want my normal life back. She's got her choker, but the choker was... Um, where these guys were looking for her to give the, the cards to her they couldn't find her because the rose uh, the necklace choker thing was protecting her and hidden away from everyone else and then obviously uh, the bat actually had the choker but he lied to her so he, she has it back on again um, but she was going, trying to go back onto her normal life you know go to the like, the arcade and thing but when she got cards the cards came out as the four coloured cards and she was like no I can't do this much so she goes back and she sees the teacher um, in the garden and he's like I wonder if I if um, he can make a blue rose he said he's made a blue rose and I want to see if I can grow one too and he started crying because and I say also and I did remember when he said um, that he remembers that if he can grow this blue rose and hopefully he can too, because he's more of the weak person, he's ill. And I was like, that's very sad. That's why they don't want him to get commanded so many often, like summoned so many times. Because he's ill and he needs to be saved more. So, there's that. In the front, it does tell you the characters. So we have Anase Yamatomote, first year of the Shobi Academy. So that almost sounds like a ninja academy. Um, she's a strong-willed girl who dreams of one day finding and dating her Prince Charming. She dislikes being the centre of attention. With these four guys, there's a lot of centre of attention. Pretty much. Then we have the Red Rose, which is Canada Higa. Um, Anase's classmate, he's an ex excellent athlete who often teases Anase. And he's a spe a spe his speciality, I can't say, is offence. Then we have the White Rose. Here, which is Mitsuri Tenjo, the president. So he's a third year and a student council president. He is very revered by both male, male and female students and super rich. His speciality is healing and defence. Then we have the Blue Rose, which is uh, Sairan um, Agasan, the one that was kidnapped. He's a first year. This, school, this boy is cuter than any other girl at school. He doesn't know he's the school idol and he's well versed in a wide range of topics. His spell speciality is alchemy, alchemy and science. Then we have the Black Rose, which doesn't she he didn't first agree with her being the chosen one. Um, is Mitsuki uh, Kurama, 
second year there's many frightening rumours about this mysterious student. Apparently he lives in the basement of a Tenjoza house. <laughs> His um, speciality is discovery and capture. Then we learn a little bit more about the teacher, the classics teacher. His name is Iksushi uh, Narumi. He's the most knowledgeable about the uh, savior, well, Suverage and her rose, no, rose Knights and the Rose Contract that binds them. They have to put a, they have to do the rose thing. And then we have the Ninu Flower, Guardian of the Garden, who has been protecting the card since ancient times. And then we have uh, Sukwaza Yamato, who is uh, the father, Anasai's father. It seems he had a motive, motive in putting the Rose Charika on Anasai. So this one, we're still trying to find out what the punishment is. So at right at the end of the book, she's now got gathered the prince, uh, the knights, and the girl with her. And the Mitsuki, he smiles. We don't see him smile when he smiles. And he's, and she, and he's like, he smiled, and she goes, you smile. He's like, no, I don't. <laughs> kind of thing. Um, and then she's uh, walking away, um, going, oh, I don't care what my punishment, kind of what, like, what is my punishment going to be. That's it. Okay, so what we got the volume, volume three up next and then that is it i hope you guys enjoy this one and i hope you guys see you next time bye bye for now